Welcome to a new update. As mentioned in the previous updates, we had some critical planetary and lunar geometry this morning. As you can see, Mercury, Venus and Saturn in a conjunction. And at the same time, or actually a little bit earlier this morning, we had a lunar conjunction also with Saturn. And that can be more critical in the coming days. 12, 13, 14 January most likely. The atmospheric fluctuations that we have already picked up on the 7th, as you may recall, that goes right from the Aleutian Islands in the north down to New Zealand. And that was on the 7th. And also we had over, well, sort of Eastern Africa and Eastern Turkey, Iran, minor Asia actually. But that looks a little bit less convincing to me. Interestingly, the fluctuations that we've picked up today, they seem to confirm the regions that were marked earlier. Again, we look at the Pacific, a little bit more to the west, from the Red Islands in the north down to New Britain region and somewhat to the west of New Zealand. That seems to be the most serious fluctuation that we've picked up so far. It is a rough estimate and we are certainly not always accurate on that. There may be other regions possibly experiencing larger earthquakes in the coming days. We can only go by the fluctuations that we are able to pick up. The other fluctuation that we picked up this morning sort of confirms what we picked up on the 7th and that is a little bit more to the east, east of Madagascar actually, and more in the direction of Pakistan and eastern Iran. These are the fluctuations that we picked up so far and 12, 13, 14 January seems to be the window for larger, possible larger seismic activity based on the critical planetary geometry that we have or had this morning. How large the seismic activity is going to be? Well, the Pacific usually experiences the larger earthquakes, but mind you, Pakistan, Afghanistan and also Iran, there can be earthquakes into the magnitude 7 range. Again, I'm not sure how much the fluctuations over Eastern Africa and East of Africa are worth. We picked them up and I mentioned them here uh, sort of just in case. It doesn't necessarily mean that there will be a larger earthquake in the coming days, but this is what we've been able to pick up so far. It is a rough estimate. Please keep that in mind. We cannot do better than that. We have the fluctuations and we mark them on a specific side of the planet, but it is still possible that some fluctuations are missed or that we are not able to pick them up or that an earthquake or an upcoming earthquake will not even leave a footprint in the atmosphere and there can be larger seismic activity in a completely different area. That is possible. We had the planetary and lunar geometry this morning. If larger seismic activity arrives early, it could be tomorrow on the 11th already. My estimate is that 12, 13 and 14 will be the most critical time frame. Until next time.